Hello everyone, welcome to a World of Worship Bits video. Today's video is another respawn video. This video is probably, well, for those of you who may have missed it in the starting screen, this video is uh, probably a little bit unexpected because the ship that we're in is the um, Tier 6 Commonwealth Cruiser, the Mysore, which, um, yeah, well, I thought I'd take out for a spin. So this is not on the press account. Um, in the last Blitz Pass, I managed to get... I didn't manage to complete the Blitz Pass, but I managed to get to the point of the uh, Mysore. And to be fair, the price was pretty low, so um, I bought the Blitz Pass and got the Mysore. So I'm hoping that they buff it, because I think the ship definitely could do with a buff. Um, but in the meantime, we have another hard ship for hard mode. And bringing in an AP only, no torpedoes, um, cruiser, light cruiser with bad concealment, into a respawn game is probably, well, it's probably not the wisest decision, but here we are. We're here anyway. So, um, so what the Mysore has is rapid reload, which um, I'm going to have to tell you up front. Um, I remember playing this game very vividly. Um, that rapid reload is pretty pointless. <laughs> it, just, it just doesn't feel like it does much. You know, if it was maybe uh, two times speed or something like that, it would be fantastic, but this little old rapid reload that, um, well, for, apart from the fact that um, the ship that we were trying to rapid reload against is gone, um, yeah, well. And as you can see, unlike the Huang Hui, which is small enough and agile enough to um, to be mostly ignored, the Mysore is seen as a pretty rich target, and we're getting hammered pretty badly. Getting a lot of slot shops coming in, but we've got a mate coming up, so we're going to stick with this mate. Um, and provide them some support, help, help them hold the cap, keep the destroyers at bay, um, and tackle anything else we can see. So there's a Normandy, French battleship, which is sort of like got cruiser armour. Still a lot of bounces though. Uh, this New Mexico, which is pretty pointless to shoot at. So we've got a couple of battleships here. Um, what are we going to do? Uh, that's a friendly destroyer. Um, there is only one cap in this map, so that's good to know. Um, here we go, so that's uh, Pensacola, we'll see if we can give him a bit of a hammering. Um, he seems to have survived our initial salvo. They just need a little bit more guts to the guns on this thing. Um, yeah, the Mysore needs something anyway. Here's the Ernst Gator. Badly, badly hit. Um, we've got our, um, and is that a New Orleans? I oh, don't know, no, it's um, De Grass out there. I oh, know, I can't read the, read the text. Anyway, we have a friendly cruiser out there. Um, and this Ernst Gator is, well, he's gunning for um, that cruiser, which to be fair, I think is that cruiser is trying to sort of make himself a bit of a menace behind enemy lines. But um, yeah, no can do. So here we are. We um, are holding the cap. I don't know why I'm going forward there. Uh, we've got our smoke going. We're just trying to basically make sure that we stay within the cap. Um, so that if a friendly ship comes in, we can start to reclaim it. As you can see, the smoke's starting to dissipate. Um, we'll get another lot of shots into this guy before he disappears. And then, well, sort of guesswork. Oh, our aiming reticle's been taken over by the, um, by the other ship, which means that our, our aim is already off. So here we are, we're going to put our nose in towards the um, in towards the worst of the offenders. That Dallas there, that black Dallas. I'll uh, give him some shots and then we'll see if we can sneak in behind this island. Getting pretty badly hit. Um, there's no torpedoes that we can use to chase him off, but we managed to get behind the island. Um, protect ourselves, help hold the cap. Oh, he's gone, which is good. There's no point holding with fire in this thing, like in a Huang Pei or a Perth or something like that. At this point it'd be worth holding with fire to go unseen, because I can help hold the cap unseen just as well as I can visible. Haven't got any kills yet, hoping that this makes a difference. It does. Um, yeah, so the Mysore is pretty, still pretty underwhelming, got to say it. Um, it has reasonable range, but the dispersion is sort of ordinary. Three smokes, but they're um, the fuel smoke kind, so... They're um, of limited value. We are getting some good hits in. So this is probably the highest damage score I've ever got out of any game in the Mysore. Um, 
What's this guy over here? Uh, another destroyer, Hatsuharu by the looks of it. Um, and yeah, he's gone. Getting focused by the team for a win <laughs> and surviving the game. But still, not great damage numbers. There's just not the capability to do it. There's no way to get flooding. There's no way to set fires. And um, yeah, I got one uh, Citadel, I think, against um, one of the enemy cruisers. But generally, it's a um, yeah, it's a pretty rough run. So damage taken, 225,000. Sorry, not 225,000. Damage delivered, 50,000-ish. Yeah, so um, yeah, probably about as good as it gets in the Mysore. So... Yeah, I'm not sure if it's um, if it's out there enough to, to get a buff, but you can only hope. Anyway, there you go. Respawn in the Mysore. Now you've seen everything. Hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.